Gentle is recognized. First, I'd like to thank the chairman and the ranking member. Mr. Speaker, today I rise to honor a brave American hero, Sergeant Zachary M. Fisher, from my hometown of Baldwin, Missouri. On July 14, 2010, Missouri's 2nd District lost a brave young man when United States Army Sergeant Zach Fisher was killed by an IED while serving during Operation Enduring Freedom. Sergeant Fisher was assigned to the 27th Engineer Bat Battalion of the 20th Engineer Brigade based out of Fort Bragg, North Carolina. He was 24 years old when he died at Forward Operating Base Lagman in Afghanistan. Zach graduated in 2004 from Marquette High School in St. Louis, where his history teacher remembered him as a patriotic student with an interest in how the United States developed as a country. Zach met his beautiful and loving wife, Jessica, just before his earlier deployment in Iraq. At a time of his death, they had been married for just two years. Sergeant Fisher is survived by his parents, Sue and Jim Jacobs, and Bob and Alicia Fisher, and three brothers, Andrew, Clayton, and Alexander, along with two sisters, Emily and Zoe. Zach uh, initially enlisted in the United States Army Reserves. When he told his parents that he wanted to report for active duty, they asked him to give, give them two good reasons why he would choose to put himself in harm's way in the service of his country. His reply said a lot about the character of the man, Zach Fisher. He wanted to join the Army because he wanted the discipline that it would provide, and he wanted to be part of something bigger than himself. Although the United States of America can never fully repay the priceless debt we owe to Sergeant Fisher, we can do our part to ensure that his memory lives on. Therefore, it is my honor to sponsor H.R. 322, a bill that names the Chesterfield Maine Post Office after such a courageous young man memorializing a hero who gave up his life in service to the nation that he loved. All of Zachary's friends would say that Zach was their best friend. He was a dedicated warrior whose commitment to family and friends and country will be long remembered. I am proud that this legislation will serve as a testament to the dedication and sacrifice of Sergeant Zachary Fisher, standing as a physical reminder of the bravery of one American from Missouri's 2nd District who chose to serve a cause greater than himself. Mr. Speaker, I yield back the balance of my time.